Okay, now let me be Yo, oh, it's time to edit my picture. Why waiting for me to cry? On our nose, this year about the waste of work for my house. Let I cry. For the nine say, say the place where they go, the chefs they are good. That I'll be, I'll eat well today. You will just like today. Chefs are good. Come to Messi, I tell Messi to come meet me. Messi says they. I say since after this girl to go collect, I say they talking love when they answer me. I say, oh my, they talk say I tell Messi since say Messi come back. Why Messi go just go like that? I don't know. I go say okay, what of Sharifa? Why say she they come back? Now say, now say, why you asking me of Sharifa? I say, for the first time you are defensive. Ask of Sharifa, you they say why am I asking you? I say, I say talk I in come out. <laughs> Hi Damond, welcome to the channel. So first of all, let's say congratulations to Vicky James. Okay. So Vicky James announced her engagement and proposal to the love of her life, Femi Tidy. And we can't be more excited. We are happy for her. So please say congratulations in the comments section. But as you people know, you Mogbamoya and Association of Nigeria, you people will always have something to say. <laughs> well, I know they finish, oh, well, problem not they ever they finish for the internet for us and join internet. So, after a uh, while, uh, I say Wanika Vicky James announced this her engagement. That's how stories started flying up and down. Hey. I say you people should carry your chair and sit down because it's, it, the matter is long. It's a long matter. Okay, make with the analyze and they go. So, hmm, you people remember that blog I said that I used to watch. Oh, they used to call the blog Just My Chance. Just My Chance. It was Just My Chance. I talked about this story a year ago because I still remember because I paid money to listen to Amebo. I said just my chance came out and said congratulations. I know that to Vicky James, so but uh, some things did they under the carpet. Ha, that's how the army ball people of Nigeria now gathered in Asad and they started talking. So the thing is that they said though, according to um what's her name or uh, the, the blog that um this guy that Vicky James is um engaged to so first of all he used to be Waneka. You remember Waneka? <laughs> if you have not seen Waneka's story please check somewhere and go and watch the video. That's um the guy used to be Waneka's manager. Mm. And in fact Waneka and um, Vicky James used to be very close at some point and because of this guy the the friendship scattered because um Vicky was was having affairs with the guy while the guy was working with Monica, and I think at that point too, according to the blog, <laughs> let's say it, at that point too, Monica was also having an affair with this her staff, her staff of life. So <laughs> they now started bringing out that um, Vicky is the one forcing the marriage, the engagement. That the guy does not really have a lot of money, um, and that um, Vicky is the one forcing the guy. So some people were not like, ah, ah, that the fact that a guy doesn't have as much money as the person he wants to get married to it does not mean anything, or to according to some people. Some people are like, ah, we well, have not finished the face of beauty matter where a former rich girl went to marry a guy that cannot sustain her lifestyle and problem now started. So different people were just talking. Some people were like, how will you marry somebody that caused a problem between you and your friend? So people were not like, ah, for the whole of Lagos, this girl, this rich girl, because Vicky James is actually a rich babe, okay? This rich babe, no see guy of her standards to marry. Ah, you people, the talk is plenty, oh, the talk is much. Like, if you see the comments, her commenters in Nigeria are brutal. I, I mean, I don't even know what to say, oh, because I've been thinking about the matter since. I said, like, mm, this Vicky James matter, I don't know what to say, to be honest, than to just wish her congratulations and just be going. You don't understand? Because the story is, is, is long. 
but what do people have to say because it's the people that are saying that um a girl can marry a, a guy that um she's richer than they have they have a point too because you know that uh, men have ego mm -hmm. and some people can pretend very well they'll just want to pretend to the point that no worry i'm going to chop this game on. it's very few men maybe this guy will be like that we don't know she obviously must have seen something okay and because there was even a comment commenters that was saying that um, vicky was talking in church one day that um, all the guys that have been coming to her that is because of her money they don't really love her for who she is according to the commenter i did not hear who is the commenter that said it i'm just reporting what they said so <sighs> that so the commenter was not saying that hope this one is actually genuine love and not because the guy wants to use her these things are dicey you know me i don't know how to advise people about relationship matter you have relationship coaches okay not just not just they talk but i know that to be honest there are a lot of times where um hard-working ladies Mm. when the the uh, ladies that are kind of domineering and um when i meet somebody that they think that oh the person has their best interest in heart and when they now enter inside the house it would not be as they thought okay because you there have been cases okay it's, it's not one way sure, because there are also cases where the guy will be so supportive that people will say the woman used jazz on the on the it depends on the people that are advising the guy to be honest because um it's, it varies but those are the fears some people are having and some people are like, don't put your projection on another person everybody own is different so at the end of the day i wish them well um it's just people are just talking based on what people have seen based on a uh, hair because some people are like hope um vicky is not under pressure to put herself in a certain light because maybe she makes bridal dresses i know she has really been um jesus baby jesus baby of of some for some time so hope there's no expect she's not trying to live up to anybody's expectation and rushing the process because some people are like i should, this guy's not rushing the process in order to say oh, i'm married um there's even a video um where some people were bashing her because she went for her pa's wedding and she was dressed like the bride and those type of things so i don't know um i wish her well i don't I do, now what we see on the streets that's what we'll come to talk about but those are some of the things that people are saying that mm, let this not be a case of tomorrow now you now say um it was it was nothing from the beginning you know that kind of thing but the thing me i would just suggest to anybody that is in that situation marriage is um, a long-term game and when you see yourself as a team it makes everything easier okay and um, i will always tell people around me that know me personally that look allow a man to be a man even if you have more money than that man allow him to take up the responsibility that he's supposed to as the man even if you have more money than that man keep it do you understand let him and you if you choose and say ah this is the the love of my life or this is the person i love or you know because we ladies and uh, sometimes it's out of good heart it's not because um, we're trying to dominate the man or anything we, we just want to see them succeed right but you see in that your oversubly sometimes you can rob the man of his ego and the fact that oh i did this for my wife i did this for my family and those type of things so allow him be a man if it is five thousand naira ring he can afford where i'm like that because now you say you are the one that chose him that ah, this is love of my life if you say you can afford house in um where now i don't know where are the places in lagos that are maybe uh, on the mainland instead of the island don't come and say that 
it will not be up to the standard of who i am in the society because i have money i don't know if you understand what i'm saying that's the wisdom that me i would just suggest in this type of situation you have to live according to his level <laughs> if you want peace if you want your own peace of mind i don't know some other people may not agree with this but if you if you truly you want to stay in that relationship and have peace and you are not um if you because you are the one that chose you don't see as the guy be or before you say you want to marry the guy do you understand if you want sugar baby lifestyle you have to either grow with the person or you marry somebody that already has that type of money but if you look the person not get money like that now just start her in you cannot expect that type of lifestyle from a young guy but you want to see the money so if you choose that i'm going to stay with this girl my sister you will adjust it's true i don't know what other people will suggest you know i'm not a relationship coach i just they talk uh -huh. but that's the suggestion no allow him if he can pay rent for wherever i can pay according to his money my is he not love you will love him like that inside there don't because once you try to be happy too much uh, <laughs> oh god <laughs> one day the guy go fight you he go come they feel like say she's trying to dominate me not be anything it's just a male ego okay so i know they say no what do you mean why can't i nobody says you know apple but if you want to have sense and you know you are ah, i want to love oh, it's love i came to love i'm not looking the other side it's love i want to love i want to enjoy this love for a hey allow him if he likes he has to go on i'm just saying this now please don't quote me verbatim like if he has to carry wood or whatever to provide let him it is his male you know role allow him to exercise that male something that thing to provide for you as his wife you understand sometimes you just so oh, like if you want to support let reduce reduce <clears throat> reduce this to the barest me allow him to be the man let him say I, I bought this for my wife i did this for my wife if you are doing over sabi too much it, <clears throat> if people that understand what i'm saying please help me explain it in the comment section allow if you choose if you are a girl that you are doing well all of this you have to do that thing i say they stoop to conquer okay allow him don't let him as the power rich don't come and say that oh no it's not up to my standard before i got married to you i used to go to this place i used to go to that place hey you that you would have looked for people in that category no not true you would have looked for people in that category if you choose say now this man now nah, you don't like you love him how ah, you are in love my sister you is too poor yes you will you will try and adjust to his level <laughs> because we've seen plenty of stories and that's just where some people are coming from that this thing is not like <laughs> it's not the easy oh. i pray that god will give, will give them his job because there are some guys that would say ah now my wife anything when my wife gets now me get her and they would um, be building themselves and be going and he will support the wife and everything the fact the truth of the matter is that the fact that a woman has more money does not make her the head of the home the, do you understand because there are, you, there are many women that they will have more money and their marriages have lasted for years and they are happy together because she knows how to humble herself before her husband you understand now just you know say the internet now they will just they talk with their hair but it doesn't also mean that a, a rich girl cannot get married it's just that you have to be wise okay and the guy's heart too has to be in a good place i remember there was someone who came to meet my mom one time that oh the wife was building a house and she did not tell him she she, she gathered the money to build it i said oh, that i said that not be your children go stay the house you understand at the end of the day it's both of you maybe she knew that if she tell you say she debuted house you go you know how people will now begin to have 
phantom dreams that is in the sky that used to exist then that's when they will not be having ideas oh my wife let's do it like this then the money will not scatter that's why she did not tell you so it depends on the man but me i wish her all the best um she's happy we're all happy for her okay we look forward to the wedding all right to dance and celebrate you know past like that so yeah let me share your thoughts with me in the comment section all right i'll see you in the next one bye